Hi everyone, this is Matthew Kale. I'll be your player today. The whole point of this thing is just to really show how playing video games is not as easy as it looks or how bad the player is. Uh, in that case, today it's going to be me. We're going to be playing Rival Turf, which is an early 90s game by Jalico or Jalico, or however the hell you pronounce it. You have two choices of players. I'm going with uh, Jack Flack for now. The other guy is like Ozzy uh, Newsom or whatever. And you notice that the game is pretty upfront about uh, the information. I'm not going to be talking the whole time. I'm just going to be uh, doing highlight real commentary of me getting my ass kicked by guys in uh, tank tops and biker helmets. No one even there. No one even there. I do gotta say the characters design on some of these guys, they they have that like, that beat up uh, ability. Just give you a little background on this particular game. Truth be told, these are like the games that you could have beaten in an hour if you were really good and you just knew the timing and you didn't get hit every freaking second. I will say this about the game, the, the handling of the combinations, which you don't have any, they get punch, 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 then uh, you get your flying kicks, you get uh, all that stuff. You have the ability to use the environments in certain cases, like, for example, that. You get your uh, trash can throws and whatnot. For whatever reason, you're fighting a frickin' uh, ninja in San Francisco. Like, this game is n nothing if not weird about like the way that you're uh, fighting certain characters. Graphics aren't the most beautiful thing I've ever seen on the Super NES, but I will say this: the um, there's certain little touches. Like you're not constantly fighting, going down the street. You're fighting on a bus that doesn't even seem like it's proportional at all. is the cheap shots. That's why you always gotta stay centered. I 
Continues is that you can uh, change characters. So if you don't like Jack Flag, switch to Ozzy. It's pretty much the, the same. The same. Like, the timing's a little bit different, and uh, the moves are definitely different. And that's the first level. So we're going from police street or police station to the stadium. that you face also have the ability to throw sticks of dynamite at you, but they have small explosions. movie or if it was a uh, Stallone movie where the guys would always wear jeans, tank tops, and bandanas. No, it was a very 80s thing. Maybe it was Robocop. Maybe I'm thinking of that one dude from Robocop. And of course that guy's name is Arnold and he Looks like Arnold Schwarzenegger, only fatter. Alright, now we're in the player's locker room. 